Hello everybody! Today we're going to unbox and take a close look at the Le Creuset Stoneware Pestle and Mortar. So let's just take a look around the outside of the box. So in this box is a Le Creuset Stoneware Pestle and Mortar. It has a 0.3 litre capacity or 10 ounces. And taking a look around the details of the box packaging, there's some care and usage instructions for this pestle and mortar. So it is oven, microwave oven, dishwasher, fridge freezer, grill, and broiler safe. And now let's go ahead and open up the box by pulling out the tab that's keeping the box lid closed. And let's flip up the box lid and taking a look directly in the box. And of course giving you a look at the underside of the lid with some other details of the Le Creuset products. And now let's remove the contents from the box packaging and set them on the tabletop. And just checking through, making sure nothing else is left behind. And there's some further fine detail information from Le Creuset on the inner parts of the box packaging. And just closing the box back up and setting it to the side. We'll set it on the left hand side of the table. And just removing the card insert and of course checking through making sure nothing is attached under the card. And just setting the contents on the tabletop so you have a nice and full clear view of the Le Creuset stoneware pestle and mortar. And this one is in teal. And now let's take a close-up look at the mortar and the pestle together. So you can see it does have a nice glossy enameled finish on the exterior and of course the handle as well of the pestle. And taking a look at the underside we can see the Le Creuset branding. And taking a look inside the mortar and at the head or tip of the pestle, we can see that they both have a very, very fine finish to them. Just giving you an even closer look at the details. Right there, the very, very fine finish of the head or tip of the pestle matching the inside as you can see right here with me running my finger along its inner surface of the mortar. On the exterior we can see that very shiny glaze of the enamel and of course the Le Creuset branding now it's signature three ring design just below the rim of the mortar. And giving you a full view of both items together right there. And doing a bit of rotation so you have some idea of this, this stoneware pestle and mortar together. And now let's take a look at both items but one at a time up close and in detail. So just setting the mortar to the side and taking a look at the pestle. And to give you some idea of the size resting in my hand. And of course the mortar as well. So once again, it does have a 0.3 litre capacity or 10 ounces. And once again, together for completeness. So back to the pestle and its overall design. You can see once again that finely finished glossy 
teal handle. And at the head, that very fine, kind of sandy, smooth finish. And to give you some idea of the construction and design of the pestle, just tapping on this piece of ceramic stoneware to have a better idea of this pestle. Okay, so just setting the pestle down and moving on back to the mortar and its close-up details. So top-down look, we can see that very fine finish right round the interior of the mortar. And it does have a very, very subtle depression right here, or spout, or pouring, or even resting the pestle against. So you can see this area here is slightly thinner than the rest of the edge of the rim. So just that little, little detail right there. And now taking a look right round the circumference of the mortar. And the underside as well, so you can see, does have a somewhat scalloped design. On one half of the mortar. And to give you, once again, some idea of that material looking right down inside the mortar, and you can see that contrast with its glossy enamel finish and beige or sandy plain finish inside. Of course, that's to provide it with grip when you're crushing or grinding your ingredients. And to give you some idea of the density, just tapping my fingernail against the body of the mortar. You can hear just how thick the design is of this mortar. So right there, once again, cut in my hand. And let's put both of them together, pestle and mortar, right there. And of course, giving you some idea, tapping and just running the pestle against the mortar. So a very crisp clink of the pestle against the mortar. And right there, giving you A side view of the utensils together. And once again, top down of this Le Creuset stoneware pestle and mortar. So that's the Le Creuset Stoneware Pestle and Mortar. Thanks for watching and happy crushing.